The Zamita project is a, a cooperation between Nortec, the Northern Technical College, and uh, the Swedish Embassy, and Unido, and Volvo Group. And, uh, and it's basically about uh, developing skills for young people in um, heavy industry with a, with a focus on uh, transport. The students have been offered a chance to develop real life skills. And I think the connection here to industry and the connection to Volvo and to other private companies that have been involved in the project has, has ensured that the skills that the students have got are really relevant, useful, and, and as a result, they're able to get jobs. So, I mean, I think this is a, a great opportunity for the students and also for the Zambian economy because it sort of helps create even more economic activity. And I think the, uh, the, the important thing is to keep prioritizing this kind of uh, technical education. Uh, I think there's a lot of people here who probably don't need such an academic education and technical and vocational training is, in that case, really important for them. And we've heard today from industry that they need people with these kinds of skills. So I think my advice to the government of Zambia is just to continue prioritizing this, make sure they give enough resources to Nortec and to other technical colleges like this. I mean, there's quite a few other ones around the country. I think they also need these resources and assistance. So uh, keep it, keep working on it. My name is Chidango Samba Emanuel. I'm pursuing a diploma in automotive engineering. I come from Northern Province, Kasama. My name is Katongo Mlinga. I come from Masaiti District. I'm doing automotive engineering in craft. In this course, we, we get to physically get hold of the, the machinery. Like we, we get to dismantle certain components of an automobile to manage time, housekeeping methods to design and uh, operate on an automobile from just the experience that I've had ever since I came. The school facilities uh, together with the NENIN is good compared to maybe other institutions because we are able to, to get eye contact on things that are practically involved in, in the course which is automotive engineering. I really thank Zaminta on my behalf and on the behalf of my family because I come from a family that lives uh, below 90 quarter poverty line, meaning we, we had the afford most of the, the basic needs. So Zaminta, came at a time where my family was hopeless for me to, to go at tertiary education because I have siblings who have already completed their senior secondary, but they, are, they haven't had the chance of going to, to any tertiary institution. But through Zamita, uh, I've been given this chance of acquiring a skill. So meaning the whole family is looking up to me. So meaning I have to do my level best through the hope of Zamita and my applied efforts. So I thank Zamita because they have really helped me. They have really helped my family. And I hope not to disappoint them because this chance they've given me, it's a rare chance for any any person to, to get. What I can say to my fellow women is that they can do this not only for men, what a man can do, a female can do. And we need more women in this industry. I get to experience a lot about cars, we dismantle the engine, how the parts work, in other parts of the car. I would just love to appreciate Samita for the good work they are doing. Continue reaching out to those who are in need, those who can't manage on their own. Continue doing the good work. And continue reaching out to a girl child.